Welcome, my fiends, to David Rock Nelson's Dungeon of Monsters. Yeah, yeah, I like my time, man. Check that out. Cool, huh? Yeah. That's spooky. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, see my poster of Frankenstein there, my favorite monster. And here I got my old clock here. It glows in the dark. Isn't that cool, man? <laughs> it glows blue. Yeah. So, okay. And okay. And here's a Wolfman guy I got. See, that's a Wolfman. I got that like in 1990. Not as good as the real Wolfman, you know, which is Lon Chaney. You know, this guy right here. Well, here's four. Here's four right there. This is one of my pins. But like I was going to say, the real, the real Wolfman, that's this guy. Oh, no, that's the creature. Here's the Wolfman. Where's my Wolfman pin? There it is. There it is. There's the Wolfman. Now, that's the real Wolfman. That's the way the Wolfman should look today. Instead of that digital stuff. Yeah. But I thought Rick Baker made a really cool weird Wolfman for that remake of Wolfman. That was cool. The only thing I didn't like was that the filmmakers, they added the digital stuff. They should have just left Rick Baker's makeup the way it was and had the guy running around with a werewolf makeup. Like like the olden days, you know, where they had him in makeup and they ran around. Not jumping, like, from from housetop to housetop like they do in the movies today. Like, you know, you got uh, these superheroes flying, uh, you know, jumping buildings and stuff. That's not realistic. Should have the Wolfman... Guy made up as a wolf man running around, you know, like the wolf man. You know, that would be a real wolf man today. It would be a half man, half wolf, and he wouldn't be jumping from house to house. Wolves don't jump that far, pal. You know, so some of you filmmakers need to, you know, go back old school and start doing, you know, the good old fashioned effects. And don't overuse the digital. You're doing too many of these digital effects. You know, we have people in makeup costumes like in the original Planet of the Apes. That's a classic. That's the way it should be done. Not digital images. So you have the, uh, somebody in a suit. Get that, bring back the monster suit. Like the guy walked around with a dinosaur suit with the miniature sets, stomping on miniature sets like the original Godzilla. Guy that was, that was great. That's the way they should do it now. Uh, I like King Kong versus Godzilla. That was the first one. And Godzilla versus the sea monster with a giant crab that throws the rock at him. You know? Okay, I'm gonna go to my dungeon of monsters now. I got my nice hot job and my monster Look at it smoking, man. Look at that. Nice hot steaming java, man. That is smoking. So, yeah, it was like Grandpa made it hot, you know. You know, you know when the monsters where the drinks are really hot and the smoke's coming out. Because I think they use dry ice for that. But you don't want to drink dry ice. It's just good for a special effect, but don't don't be putting that in your drinks, man. It, it could hurt you. Really. Don't be messing around with that stuff. You know, don't drink a drink that's got dry ice in it, man. That's just for a visual effect only. That's not for drinking. Amen. And don't do drugs. Drink coffee. That's a good drug. That's all, man. That's caffeine. That's the real thing. Because God made the coffee beans, so it's okay to guzzle Java. You know, it's okay to drink Java. It's okay to eat pizza. It's not a sin. Every Saturday night when I watch Fanguli, I have a pizza. Okay, let's go to my Dungeon of Monsters right now. I'll see you. Come on in. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my House of Horrors. Dave Rock Nelson's House of Horrors, House of Monsters. Okay, my fiends. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed my House of Monsters of the Ape Man today. And until next time, sleep well. And have spooky fun monster dreams. Yeah, and guzzle your job and stay up all night and watch monster movies. I think I'm going to watch Devil Bat tonight. Stay up till 3 in the morning. And then I might watch Night of the Ghouls by Ed Wood, my favorite Ed Wood movie. Okay, and I met Conrad Brooks a bunch of times. He was in my movie Conrad Brooks vs. Werewolf. So, you know, I like Ed Wood's movies. Okay, yeah, so until next time, my fiends, sleep well. And have spooky fun monster dreams. Ah! Ah! Ah!